Yeah, what's going on? So today we got a video from Police Cam Now, and the title of the video is Here's Why You Need to Know State Laws. Let's figure out why we need to know our state laws. Let's get into on it. On October 19, 2023, deputy conducted a traffic stop. Hey, how are you guys? Deputy Pollucci with the Sheriff's Office. Good, good. You know I pulled you over, sir? It's a minor misdemeanor violation. I don't know if you know when you were in the center lane, that semi. When you made a lane change, you have to activate your turn signal 100 feet ahead. So you kind of cut him off right there when I was behind him. He hit his brakes, didn't cause an accident or anything. Where are you guys at? Oh, okay. Nothing illegal in the vehicle. If I wanted to search it, could I search it? Yeah, we wanted to. Okay. You guys are going to Delaware. Where are you guys coming from? Detroit. We're on vacation. On vacation? So, so celebrating the anniversary. Okay. How, many, how long have you guys been married? Well, we technically, we're not married. Well, together. Yeah. Yeah. Ten years. Ten years? Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. So you said I could search it if I want. That's just what I do. I'm a drug interdiction officer. I just make sure there's nothing in vehicles, and then I let you roll on. I usually work with traffic, okay? Usually out-of-state plates on the turnpike and stuff like that. We get a lot of stuff traveling through. So there's nothing in the vehicle. A little bit of weed. I don't sight unless yeah, it's like serious. a... Honestly, come on, man. You ain't have to let this guy search your vehicle, bro. Traffic ticket, bro. That's... Come on, bro. Never let them search your vehicle. Whether you clean or not, it's just... No, man. Detroit, um, that's it. Bro. Like, how much weed from Detroit? Oh, well, it's like a couple of eights, some things that we got from you. Just like vapes and stuff yeah, like that? nothing like that. Do you have a medical marijuana car? No, we're going with uh, recreational. In Detroit? Yeah. In Unfortunately, it's not in Ohio, but I don't charge it, but we will end up seizing it, just uh, so you know. Uh, so how much is it? I know in, in Ohio, every state's different. It's not here yet in Ohio where it's it's legal, okay? So is it a lot, or how much is it? It's just like a couple of... I'm not, I'm not. Just leave it there. I Just just for our safety, my safety, your safety, so I don't... I'm going to say it's not a lot. I mean, it is like a... Some eights, some three rows. Okay. Just push me. All right. Well, do me a favor. Be careful because the Interstate 80 is super crazy. I just want both of you guys to hop out go back here. I'm just going to do a probable cause search of the vehicle, okay? Yeah, like I said, it ain't And I appreciate you cooperating. Yeah. Honestly, if it's not pounds or nothing yeah, like that, we usually say. Personal, personal okay. I'm gonna do a search of it. I'm sorry, I can't see what else I'm doing. No, you're fine. Take your time, man. Yeah, you know what? I'm not going to Okay. That's all right. It'll only take a minute. If you guys just want to step back to my. There's like, like little house baggies, eights, just okay. personal stuff that we got from this message. Okay. There's right. no like pounds or none of that other shit. I gotcha. Yeah, it's unfortunate it's it's not here yet in Ohio, you know what I mean, so. Can you do me a favor? Do you mind if I just pat yeah. you down for outside? I just want to make sure you don't have any weapons, so we're all on the same page. And your wallet, do you have anything in your wallet or anything I should be concerned with? It's called a lucky dollar. A lucky dollar? Yeah. <laughs> you never know. You know how you get one dollar short for something? I, I got you. Can you take the line into your pockets? How yes. we call it, buddy? Yes. Here. I just leave this up here. Do you have anything on you, ma'am, or anything in your pocket? What I'm going to have you do is just have a seat in the rear of the cruiser. If you want to let your your wife in. Oh, they're going somewhere. So if you want to let your wife in, you have to untake the, the seat belt down, okay? And then just have a seat. I'm just going to do a search of the vehicle, okay? You guys are just detained. Obviously, you guys have been cooperative. I take that into consideration. We're out here trying to seize drugs, not just a little bit of weed, so. 
All right. Look at this dollar bill in here and see what's in it. Oh, no, you're fine. He's saying there's stuff in the car. He's saying there's stuff in the car, so What's that? really search it. There's an odor of weed, but he said they have a pre-rolled stuff because they're from Michigan. Oh, I bet it's in this right here. It's in that wallet. I saw him putting something back as I pulled him over. I'm going on mute. going on mute come on not shady bro you ain't supposed to be doing that ah, all right you have the right to remain silent anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law you have the right to talk to a lawyer before any questioning and have him present with you while you are being questioned if you cannot afford to hire a lawyer one will be appointed to represent you before any questioning if you wish you can decide at any time to exercise these rights or not answer any this questions to make any statements. you understand that um are you willing to talk to me now Okay. okay. So, unfortunately, like we talked about earlier, there's more than personal use in there. There's numerous bags of marijuana. There's also THC liquid that holds a certain weight. There's gummies. There's way That's more. What I, say. I, got it from the I, I understand that you got it from a dispensary, but in the state of Ohio, it's still a controlled substance. So that's more than personal use. It's more weight with the THC liquid. So right now, whose is it? It's all your stuff. Okay. It's a felony of the fifth degree marijuana trafficking, okay, and THC hashish. They're going to be felony of the fifth degree, okay? It's unfortunate, but that you have way more than personal use. You have to be careful with boundaries you cross. It might be legal in Detroit, but it's not legal in the state of Ohio. Depending on that weight of that liquid or that hashish, that could, could be more. We're going to have to weigh it out and everything once we get it in there to see if it's open or not, okay? It's unfortunate. I know I told you if there's just a little bit in there, but that, that's way more. We have an entire bag full of stuff, okay? Do you have any questions for me? No, what's, 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 what's up with my lady? Is she all right? She's, she's fine. Can she drive You're saying it's all yours? This That's bullshit, bro. Honestly. Like, you could, you could tell by the way it's... Bro, come on, bro. Like, I, I get it. I, I get it. You know what I'm saying? I, it's, it's, a, it's a lot. It is a lot, but they're not trafficking. Like, you could tell that they're not trafficking, bro. Like, that's, that's, is probably, they went on vacation, try to bring some, bring in some things back, celebrate, and like, you know, it's in proper packaging. Like, it's not like no, like, nickel bag or no little, like, Ziploc bags or something. Like, it's not, that's, oh my God. I, I, I. I feel bad for them. Like, you know what I'm saying? But he should have never gave them consent to serve. Bro, all right, I was serving or whatever. All right, whatever. Write me my ticket and let, let me get going. But you letting them search and all of that? Like, come on, bro. Yes. All right, and we can give her all the information. I'll give her my business card where she can contact you at the Portage County Jail. Okay, you're going to get a phone call once we get you in there and booked in, okay? It's just... We can't work with that when you have that amount, okay? Anything else? No, I'm going to pat you down just to double check. And unfortunately, we are going to have to seize the money in your wallet as well, okay? Due to it being trafficking. Do you know how much you have in your wallet? That's only like $50, $60. That's what I was using for gas to get home. Where is the money? Right it's not right. in the wallet right there. That's just kind of what goes along with trafficking, okay? You got to be real careful. Real careful. Which crossing the state lines and stuff like that. So we will give her a card, number, address where you're at, okay? And she'll be able to be in contact with you. You'll be fine. You'll have court. Today is Thursday. You'll have court tomorrow morning. And then she can come scoop you up. Tomorrow morning? Yeah, you'll have court tomorrow. You'll be in jail overnight. This one? Yeah. What kind of like a dollar over there? Maybe. Was it something I searched earlier, maybe? No, no. There's in the car. There's a wallet in the car. 
So what is she supposed to do? We're not even from around here. What are we supposed to do? She's going to have an opportunity to, uh, you know, come and pick you up. It's going to be, you know. So I do have to take these keys off you, and then I'm just going to. Can you give it to my girl, please? Absolutely. Can you step out real quick? I gotta do another pat. You don't have anything. We do have a body, full body scanner, okay? I'll let you talk to her. You've been super cooperative. This is. Can you get my phone, please? Absolutely. Do you want your wallet and your phone? Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. If you could have a seat, sir, I'm gonna buckle you in. And then you want this window down? Yeah, when I go to court, am, am I able to like to plead guilty or whatever? Like, what am I supposed to do? Cause That's I, a, I can't give you uh, advice on like anything like that with the courts, okay? But I, you're going to get an opportunity to talk to the judge and everything over what occurred, okay? All right, uh, you just uh, get in my phone, please. Yep, absolutely. If you uh, want to stand over there, ma'am, I'm just going to get him in here, and then you're welcome to talk to him. Um, babe, babe, just call him out. Happy just to advise the subject out there. Gotta call the mom. All right. I'm gonna try to get this seatbelt around here, big guy, so. And I always. Drug trafficking, really? Like that? Come oh my God. I'm just like this. I, I feel bad for him. Like, I do. Like, honestly, like, that's, that's, that's a tough break, bro. But. You got to know you got to know your rights, bro. There's no way I'm giving them to search the car, bro. It's quiet for that, bro. You you said that I was driving too close or whatever. All right, give me my ticket. Let me go. You know my citation or whatever and keep it moving, bro. That's that's just nah, like trafficking really? Like that's not even they not even no. And they got the receipt. That's why, oh that's my why. God. Oh, shit. Yeah, I mean, oh, it's got her name on it, dude. I know, but. Oh. Watch when I get in the mood. No time for the fakes when you see me, I see you, no FaceTime. Hey. Shoot my shot, green beam. 2K shit that get a nigga lean.